I'm babysitting and Silas is hanging out, watching TV. I can only make one of my eyebrows go up. You can make it like this. I can make both of them go like that, but you know how, can you do one at a time? <laughs> <laughs> You're so silly. Can I both of them go up? That's a good thumbnail. Look at how good of an aunt I am. Look at these cute little ketchup ears. Hey guys, so I was just going to bed, but I just thought of something. If Jesus was a Jew, does he not celebrate his own birthday then? I just got done mowing my lawn. It was a lot of work. I'm covered in dirt and sweat. Jim, you like it? Does it look good? So basically I just realized that in all of my footage so far for this vlog and in my last vlog, I just had my hair thrown up in a top knot and little to no makeup on. And I'm like, I decided that I need to fix that. Alright. That's all set. Okay, we just went to Dairy Queen and got a bunch of food. And Alex got me a foot long hot dog. This freaking thing is huge. Hold on, hold on, hold on, Jim. Oh, he's way too big for it. Look at how cute it is, though. He's pissed. Oh, he's gonna attack it. He always does this. Oh, he's pulling it over his cute little eyes. Okay, come here, I'll take it off. <laughs> Kitty, oh my God, it's so cute. I'm sorry, Jim. I'm sorry, but I had to try it on you. I had to see if it would fit. I think it might be a little too small. I was thinking like, oh, I should go online and do some personality tests. That might be fun. That's something that I always like to do. It's interesting. I spend some time being introspective. So then I thought like, oh, of course, like the first one I should do should be a sociopath test. But now I have to find one that's not like BuzzFeed or some bullshit like that. This is SciMed. Dot info. It says, if you wonder sometimes, am I a sociopath? <laughs> Which of the following statements more accurately describes your social life in middle slash high school? I was a quiet kid and others didn't notice me much. I was bullied a lot. Sometimes I had quarrels with other kids and I usually fought back. I had many fights and quarrels and got a reputation as being a bully. Okay, well, I wasn't bullied and I wasn't a bully. I was really quiet, especially in middle school, I was super quiet, so I'm going to say that one. Social rules are established for cowards, weak, and stupid people to obey those who are strong and brave enough to rule the world. I feel like that's a very ignorant, like, way to live, if you think that. Laws mainly exist to control people, not to protect or serve them. I do agree. Well, it depends, because some laws... I think the idea of laws exists mainly to control people more than protect and serve them. I mean, how many times have you dealt with the cops and then been like, I'm here to protect and serve you. If I want something, I'm ready to do anything to get it. Pff, disagree. It's not me. If people have no guts to break the rules for getting what they want, they deserve their fate as losers. 
disagree. When anyone provokes me, I get into a fight. No, never. <laughs> I've never gotten in a fight before in my life. Your score indicates that you have no sociopath personality traits. If you feel that you have problems, however, you might have a cluster B dramatic personality disorder. What is that? So my camera just died, but I want to do a quick little outro and just say I hope you enjoyed watching the video. If you did, by the way, sorry that I'm like losing my voice right now. I don't know if it's because it's late or what is going on, but... I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And have a good night or day. Hey Jim, what did the cat call the mouse? A meows. <laughs> I thought of that joke the other day. And I thought it was hilarious. Ah, Jim doesn't like it. He doesn't like it. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Um, sorry that this outro looks like shit. And see you in the next one. Bye.